Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. It's Janae. So in this video, we're gonna be vlogging. I haven't, excuse him, he's like playing the game and talking. So hopefully he's not too loud, but today we're gonna be vlogging. I haven't vlogged like, I think it's been like a month. I'm not really sure, but I'm not really doing much today. I'm just going to Ikea. But yeah, I'm just going to Ikea to find a rug for the baby's room. So in the last vlog, I was going to show you guys her room, but my finger was covering the mic, so I have my camera on an actual tripod now, so I'm going to just show it to you guys now. Um, Listen, it ain't really nothing at all. Like, the room is not decorated. I'll just really show y'all at the closet, so let's go. Alright, so this is her room. All that stuff down there... All that stuff down there is basically Jason's stuff that he needs to get up and put away. Um, yeah, so it's just like random stuff down here. Um, only thing I really bought for like the room so far are these three little elephants. I got them from TJ Maxx, thought they were really cute. So I also got this photo album from Walmart. So I'm going to start filling that up. Probably with pictures of me and Jason like while I'm pregnant and then when the baby comes, you know. Fill it up with pictures of her. And this is her closet and everything we have so far. So this is what we have so far. Oh, and by the way, thank you to anybody who has bought anything from my registry. Really, really appreciate it, guys. So this is what we're working with so far. So, so back there is the crib that Jason needs to put together. So I want to go to Ikea first to look for a rug to put on the floor so the crib can go on top of that. I went to TJ Maxx looking for one, but they didn't have like any rugs out, which was crazy. So, so we're going to go to Ikea and look for one. By the way, guys, this hair is the same hair that I just did for the... Um, Halloween makeup and hair from Domily and it's really pretty. All I did was like comb the waves out, throw in a hat. That's me like on an everyday basis and that's how it looks. So yeah, let me go get Jason and we're gonna be out of here. Hi Smokey. You wanna say hi to people? Okay, so before I forget y'all, do not judge my room. I'm gonna clean it up, but I wanna show you guys my stomach. So I am 32 weeks today and this is how I'm looking. So this is me from the front. And me from the side and everything's been going pretty well I went to the doctor last Friday I think or sometime last week and um they told me I had like a textbook pregnancy so everything is pretty normal so this is what I'm looking like all right guys so we have made it to Ikea I have Jason with me say hello all right guys so we made it to the rug section I'm not really seeing anything I'm just seeing a bunch of like adult rugs so we're gonna walk to the kids section to see if they have any rugs I'm not really sure if they do but already my legs are tired I'm tired of walking I don't know how long I can do this for okay I don't want anything too childish now what is a child what do you mean I know but you sound ridiculous. <laughs> okay the yellow is cool nothing's on it oh whoa I got that yellow with pink. Oh, it's blue. that. Ew. That's it's ugly. ugly. That one is like super ugly, y'all. Oh, that's all the rugs they got. What's this? this? I mean, the stripe ain't bad. It's gonna be barely covering the full crib. Yeah, I know. Let's keep looking. Okay. Might be able to just get one on Amazon. So then we, won't, we ain't gonna know how it feels and the size and all that. So we ended up getting nothing. Um, I'm gonna try to pick up some other stores that we could go to the poor rug. I just felt like all the ones in Ikea were like a little too grown and then the kids section they were like really really small so it wouldn't work for what we're trying to do. So I'm not sure where we're about to go now but I just wanted to let y'all know that we didn't get anything at all. So now we are in Walmart looking at rugs and like I said they have some some are kind of basic though I feel like these are options they might have some in the kids section too of like maybe like bedding or something I'm not really sure All 
All right, so we're gonna head to the baby section and look for like bedded for the crib because as of now we don't have any. So we're gonna see if Walmart has anything like that for us. Couldn't really find a rug in here. So I might look on Amazon to see what I can find. Yeah. All right, so we have the mattress, right? I have home. no idea to be completely honest with you. All right, okay. So where would we find the bedding? I feel like my lips are like really dry. Would it be down here? Oh, toddler bedding, infant bedding, down here. All right, let's see. Let's see, let's see, let's see. I don't know what I'm looking at. All they have is like two options. These are the blankets for the bed? Yeah, for the crib. No, that's a set. Blankets are like right there. But we don't like the way that looks. I don't like that. So I guess oh, we could just. This, honestly. It's only those two options as a set. That's what I'm so, saying. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. So we could just get the fitted sheet and just get a blanket to put on there for now. You know, when the crib is up, just to have it. You know, somewhat. At least a sheet on there. But that's not gonna be. What? Then, what's the point? We can. Why can't we use a cream sheet? It's just a gray sheet, a cover for the mattress. Why wouldn't we use that? I feel like a set would include that, though, wouldn't it? So do, we can have more than one sheet. One well, pan, but what's the point of paying ten dollars for that sheet if you can just get bedding later? <laughs> get the sheet or the thing that goes with the mattress cover and the set instead of paying ten dollars for one sheet. Well, what are we doing? I have no clue. <laughs> I thought we were looking for a rug. I ain't know we were gonna come here and look for some sheets. <laughs> Didn't make off your logic, my guy. So basically today was just a waste. Complete waste. We didn't get anything. Nothing at all. I got something. Oh, what do we, what do we need for the house then? We need some paper towels. Yeah. Should I just get that? I guess. All right guys, so I am back home. So after Walmart, we stopped at Cosmo Prof and I'm gonna show you guys what I got. So I mostly got things to dye this wig with. This wig is from RPG Show. And it already came blonde, so I'm gonna lighten it a little bit more and put a color on top. So I'm really excited about that. I've always wanted to work with RPG Show, but, but they contacted me last year and they wasn't trying to pay me what I wanted, so I didn't do it. And this year, I guess they got their act together, so we'll be doing a video together. But I'm gonna show you guys what I got from Cosmo Cross. So I got it all in this bag right here all right so first thing first thing i got are some gloves 100 comes in here they're black and i get the size medium next i got some new color brushes um these are by from R as well and it's three of them pink purple and black so i got some new brushes to work with also got some lightener by joyco i'm gonna be using this lightener to um, lighten that wig up a little bit and I got and I also got 20 volume by Joyco that's developer by the way shampoo too by Paul Mitchell um so I have a big bottle of this but I think it's at the shop so I wanted to get a small one to do a video because I'm gonna be doing a video on like my top favorite products so this will be one of them so I went and just got another one I got the color I'll be using in these boxes the color I got is Chrome Olive and it's by Wella. And it's in this box. Um, I don't know, hopefully it turns out good because I really don't want to mess this wig up. And I think, did I bring it? I don't think I have it. And the one thing I forgot to get, I don't even know what it's called, but, but you know like when you do color, you have like the little thing that you slide in the tube and you just twist so it can come out easily. I think I don't, I don't think I have one here. I have like three at the shop, but I don't know if I bring one back home with me. If it's not in this little bag, then I don't have one, which sucks. Oh, I have one. Okay. So what I was talking about was this. Mine is like dirty, but it's this thing. So we are good. So, but yeah, that's all I got from Cosmo Prof. So I'm about to... Set this wig up on a stand. I'm gonna bleach it a little bit more to get it, you know, just a tiny bit lighter. And then I'm gonna go in with the color and see how it turns out. I hope it turns out good because 
I'm pretty excited to do a video on this wig, so pray for me, y'all, that it comes out good. And really, that's about it. Um, so basically all I did was bleach it with 20 volume and then I put the Wella color on it. So I'm not going to show you guys the finished result because I am doing a video on it. But yeah, I don't really be doing much y'all. I just be chilling. So again, sorry if this vlog was, you know, a little boring and short. But make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you in the next one.